that. No, no, she's no. put that down. That's I not will. fair. That's Did work. anyone in here actually do any work? Yep. Do you always have to bring everyone down? It's called maturity, Nicole. Try it sometime. Hey, I just thought of something. You guys could have a wrestle and sort it out, and I'll just watch. Well, I don't have the problem here. Come on. When you find the time, we need some clean glasses. Thank you. You don't have to always let her boss you around like that. Well, she's all right. Okay, I see what's going on here. What are you talking about? Belle. You like her, right? <sighs> well, anyway, she doesn't like me. She hates me, so... Are you sure? I mean, I've seen the way that she's been looking at you. Hey, Nick, I thought I told you to clear the tables outside. You have been making me work like a slave all week. I mean, when do I get a break? Not any time soon. Now go do it. Oh. You've been pretty hard on her. Well, after a stunt with her party, it's what she deserves. And one thing I know about Nick, she can take as good as she gives. How about you? Still catching up with your dad for lunch tomorrow? Yeah, I guess. I thought you guys were getting along okay. Yeah, we are. It's just... You know, it's kind of weird. What's the problem? <sighs> he keeps asking me when I'm going to come home. Look, I know... Moving in with you was only meant to be temporary, but I know, Raymond, I just, I don't think I'm ready to go back yet, you know? Well, then don't. You can stay with us as long as you like. No, oh, thanks. All I'm saying is I get why Nicole's been darkened. My dad's making them work like 24-7. <laughs> Look, it's not my problem, okay? She's the one that threw the party, she can take the blame. <sighs> Look, since when did you care anyway? Um, I live with her, idiot. I have no choice. So? If you don't like it, move back in with your old man. Axel! Been looking for you. Ah, oh, too bad. I don't talk to tosses. You are scum, Axel! You are scum! 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 You mess with the mates, you mess with me, Campbell. I'm gonna get you for this, Axel. I'm gonna get you, not care how long it takes! Back up. Tell me what the hell that was about. Jeff has every right to be angry. What the hell have you done this time, mate? Nothing. The guy's crazy. Anyway, thanks for backing me up. So how's the job going? Um, working hard? Yeah, it's okay. I mean, he's a pretty fair boss, so I so know where I stand with him. You look up to him, mate. Oh, he's a good guy, that's all. So, how's, how's everything with you? You work going okay? You know, it pays the bills, you know. You still thinking of maybe doing that TAFE course? Or? Oh, I think I'll leave the studying to you. You got some good marks in your midterm exams. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I mean, it's really the end of year ones that count, so I can still stuff it up. If I get some good marks, then if I can get into the course that I want to. Well, it's the only way you're ever going to build up a decent career. Not like your old man. <laughs> you okay, Dad? I mean, coping all right on your own, yeah? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm good. I'm looking after myself. Eating right, you know. You're on a bit of a health kick, eh? Oh, absolutely. Clean as a whistle. I'm happy if you are, son. Nothing else matters. Well, better get back to it, I suppose. I'll fix up the bill. Oh, no way, no, no. It's my shout. I'll fix it up as soon as I finish this. What's the point of having a job if I can't buy my old man lunch? moving back home it's not that I don't want to I'm just I'm just not sure if I'm ready to yet yeah well there's no need to hurry we can talk about it again in another few weeks I thought you wanted me to move back home yeah I do but I also want to do things right this time Thanks for today, it's been good. Yeah, yeah, it's been great. 
I'm glad we're back on track. Yeah. Well, I'll give you a call. Yeah. Bell Axel hurt Melody, and I'm scared that Jeff is going to hurt him. Hurt her how? None of your business. Annie, if Axel's done something wrong, I want to know about it. Just tell us what happened. At the party, Melody was in Nicole's room, and uh, Axel came in and found her alone. She, uh, Melody told him to stop. She asked him to leave her alone, and he just wouldn't listen to her. Well, how far did he go? She fought him off, but now Axel's telling her she has to keep it a secret. Melody is going to hate me now. I promised her I wouldn't tell anyone. No, Annie, you have done the right thing. When... When Leah gets back, I'll go look for Jeff. In the meantime, you go home in case he turns up there. I'll help you look for Jeff. Yeah, I think we should split up. If you see Axel, I want to know about it.